Which influencer makes the most money? You guys always spam number 50 when you guys hear my name. And I'm not rich, boys. I am not. I wish I was rich. I wish. I truly wish I was rich. But sadly, I am not. I know you, give me, looks, you give me like so bougie looks. I will like, put you in the front. I agree. Actually. Yeah. Really? Yeah. yeah. I'm going to shoot down like you. So. I disagree. I personally believe you probably make a <laughs> billion dollars. <laughs> I agree. I was going to say the same thing. He gives me ga maybe gamer. Yeah. Let's. I'm going to put him in the middle. He's oh. still mentally here for me. I feel like your shoes. Holy <laughs> shit. What a queen. My God. She got the Mrs. Incredible pants on too, wearing them confidently. Rhea are kind of expensive. I can't tell if it's like a knockoff, but quality platforms are usually like Plus the all black. 200 the all black. to $300. You give Somebody said, I don't care if she's an influencer. Oh, she's not influencing me to do nothing. Why are you saying that? Oh, no, the only thing she might influence me is to go get McDonald's. Oh my God. Like, don't, don't laugh. Like, Chad, if you guys laugh, you're going to hell. So I'm going to try you. I'm going to look you dead in the eye. I'm going to read out what somebody just said. What if she's not an influencer? She's an inflatable. What? Her pants button is holding on to its life. You're going to hell. I think Rhea should be one more ahead. Okay. I would put Josh, like, further right in front up. of me, like, maybe? Yeah, maybe between you two. Yeah, I agree. I would be good right here. Josh, no, no, Josh, no, on, Josh. Come Josh, on. where's your sweater from? H&M. H&M. Okay. Um, but H&M's like a classic though. Like I know a lot of guys who wear like only H&M, but they make good money. Well, it's because like a lot of girls wear Fashion Nova, but they're wearing- There's nothing wrong with H&M. Why are you trying to act like, ma'am, don't do that again. Cause most of my clothes I get from H&M. Nice, elegant wear. Actually, I don't get it. Sitina gets it from me. I let my wife dress me up cause it makes her happy. You know me chat. I don't give a f how I look IRL. Like a thousand dollar shoes. Yeah. True. So I don't hate this lineup. Yeah. yeah, I'm, I, yeah I kind of think it's you think this is the lineup? Okay. Yeah, at least they'll be safe if the, you know, the room floods or something. What? What the f*** am I saying? Sorry. Order, play my dono. See like how I let everybody's donation play but yours, Broder? Because if I play your donation, I swear to God, it's not only going to give me a headache, but like I can literally tell where the donation is coming from. It's coming from you and it pisses not only me off, but the chat off. So if the chat get, types question mark and question marks your dono, like I'm going to, I'm going to sell you out for five subs. A Dota block man shut you as up. You call me Kung Fu Panda. Snorlax, guy from Doctor Strange. Bro, I can keep doing Zingus Aunt Joe's hat wah wah. Fine gift to Chinese band. I see the A, bro. Like type on keyboards, I make like custom ones. Um, and I also now I'm getting into like clothes, so I designed this hoodie. I feel mm. like you're great with money. So mm -hmm. even if you maybe technically didn't like bring in as much as some other of us a couple years ago, you maybe have grown it more because you're probably very smart. I'm sure you're investing. I feel like you absolutely I think go higher up. up. How many TikTok accounts do you have? Three that have done well. You should second. take my spot. I'm I would scary over here. Third. Yeah, I would, I would put you like second. Let's do second. Tech is a lot of money. Plus you have all those other income streams. Wait, why is she not moving, ma'am? We know that you're not fond of moving, but you need to move a little bit to the left now. So I teach people how to be content creators, but I'm also a Twitch streamer. Do you sell a course? I was just about to ask. Ah, I don't sell a course because I believe in like making education free for people. So I don't like paywalling info. How do you make your income um, without the ads? So I get $2.50 for every sub that I get. Chat, I'm an honest man. I don't get $2.50 for every sub I get. I get $3.50 for every sub I get. That's like one way that I make my money and TikTok sponsorships yeah. mainly. And I also have like Instagram and YouTube and stuff, but they're like really small. I mean, those are two pretty lucrative. I'm not gonna lie, I'm mad thirsty and I keep drinking air to try to find something to drink. You know what I'm saying? I'm hoping that like an extra drop comes out on my tongue. Like, but also you have a lot of morals, which makes me think you don't make as much money. <laughs> you haven't sold your soul. Yeah, I mean, that with the LA rent rising though. <laughs> I still don't think you should be last, though. Like, I don't feel like she should move until we hear a couple more. Yeah, yeah, I would keep myself down here. I was here. gonna be like, bring her here. <laughs> uh, so I do a few different things. Uh, um, my big one is I am a sex educator. So I host- Ma'am. Ma'am. Podcast, we just launched the third season. So I've been doing that since 2019. 
Uh, and I do sex education content on my Instagram as well as on my TikTok. And then I also upload all the podcast episodes to my YouTube channel. Ooh. Oh, I YouTube is and she's been doing it for three years. Episodes. But my, my one caveat is sex education, which in terms of making money through sponsorships, not many companies would want to unfortunately work with a sex educator, even yeah. though I think it's like a cool And thing. it's harder to get ad revenue because yeah. um, I'm constantly, you know, working Shadow through band. bands mm -hmm. and things like that. How are you making most of your money though? Through all of those, as well as OnlyFans. What you showing, your mosquito bite? Hold on, I knew I recognized that girl Haley in the middle. Where, let me see. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. What are you? Yeah, you're going to hell. OnlyFans have such an uncapped potential. I would put you up here. Third? Third? Like top three for yeah. sure. Okay. All right, so uh, I make like... Thank you, Dark Ring. I just around like money and I try and teach Gen Z uh, good like money habits with short... This motherfucker is the type of guy to be like, you just send the link a couple to your face. It's part of the pyramid scheme bullshit. Like you get $20 per link that somebody joins, some shit like that, right? Short little funny videos. Finance uh, makes so much money because not yeah. only do they push it, <laughs> but you also get so many sponsorships, especially from YouTube. Are you on YouTube or are you on primarily TikTok? It, it goes like in this order, TikTok, Instagram, YouTube stuff. I feel like those videos also, especially in the way you do them with comedy, are super shareable. Like those are the kind of TikToks that end up on Reels. They oh my God, did I tell you guys this by the way? I went to an arcade to take Dog and Danny, two of my mods, to the arcade. A fucking 13 year old kid came up to me and he knew me from TikTok. What? I only got like 100k followers on TikTok as well. I would put you up because you do finance. Yeah. Finance is such a lucrative niche. I'm, I'm okay with that. <laughs> yeah. He's like, yeah. Okay, I am a TikToker. I knew it. <laughs> I knew I could tell. Uh, I do like mostly fashion stuff, like secondhand fashion, vintage stuff. And now I just like do fashion stuff. Do you do it full time? Yeah. Just so your stuff. revenue comes from sponsorships? Yeah, it's like all social media now. I don't know, fashion makes like no money That's unless true. you're a thin white oh woman. Excuse me, ma'am. Ma'am, Haley, like, ma'am, you have no room to talk. Ma'am, you have no room in general. There's visibly fat plus size people, and then there's people with the quintessential perfect curves. Like almost, unfortunately, how plus size are you? You do lifestyle, but you're a small creator, you get nothing. Like they yeah. literally yeah. only gifting campaigns, and then like even then they gaslight you into feeling like you should be grateful for it. Yeah, absolutely. But given, I'm guessing you sound like you're a very large creator, and then like I feel like I've seen your videos on my pre page. I would maybe put you first. Oh, don't do that. Yeah. I'm also, this is like my first year doing this. Yeah, I say, I'd say right here. I don't me. think I make more than you. We, we still have time to switch. So. That's true. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, so I um, am a plus size supermodel, so everything I do is pretty much lifestyle around that. And it's been my full time job for about four years now. I have. So why was she making fun of her about being a model too? Like, oh, you're a skinny white girl, of course you get the model. Like, what? Bro, you're a model too. What the fuck are you saying? I don't know how, but what? What the fuck did I just. I have my own cannabis and sexual wellness podcast. So I do that separately. I also have my own consultation and coaching business where I teach aspiring plus size models. So I have an online course. <laughs> Somebody said she looks like a Beyblade. I would put you first. Absolutely. Like, just, yeah. yeah, you have Absolutely. so many streams of income. So many streams of income. Yeah. I, you just seem very, very knowledgeable. And what about you, Kazumi? I do OnlyFans. Let me let me ask why a woman do this. Why is it that when I go on TikTok or wherever I go, there's a beautiful woman on there, and she's just doing a zance, killing it, right? It's like, and then and when you see the comments, a bunch of women are commenting going, what a joke. Like, we saw what you did there, you loser. Or like, she's so egotistical and nasty. Fuck this video. But then when a woman on the, on the overscale size, like, um, how do I say this? A woman like Haley, right? No disrespect to her. But when she does that same dance, why is it that the, the same woman in the comments are like, slay queen, slay bitch, love that, you killing a girl, you are so confident with your butt. Why is that a thing? Why are they the guy, like, why are they lying to one another? I make like seven to 10 TikToks and I just like pump out as many reels of me as I a can. A day? Yes, with, wow. different, with different captions and I just lead it back to my OnlyFans. But I do, I make a lot of memes. That's like my kind of like niche. I make porn Do you have memes. a billboard in WeHo? <laughs> yeah, I do, I do. Wait, what? Kazami, please notice me. Oh my God. I can't do this anymore. Oh, I saw okay. that. Yeah. Do you take sponsorships? No, I'm a sex worker. So they don't, sponsors don't want me or my face to represent their brand. You're trying to get your elite diaries done? Let me know if this is optimal. What is this? No way you're trying to catch a shampi like that. Oh my, is that Haley? What is she doing there? I 
completely understand the second mm -hmm. they hear that you have any sort of like OnlyFans or sex work. Yeah, and I've gone and deleted like seven times. Yes. Where do you rank? Like, what's your percentage on OnlyFans? I'm 0.01%. Oh shit! I get your ass to number one spot. Okay, number All right. one. What? Number one. <laughs> I'm number have one. To switch. Absolutely. How many guys have you been with? Um, I used to do parties and I would get for like 50 dudes a night. Okay, so you're on no. Oh my god, that is not her, bro. That sounded like a man. I'm sorry, bro. Like, well, I'm not even trying to be like a dickhead. Like, what the fuck? Okay, so you're on No Jumper. Yeah. I'm That's the kind of video that goes viral. I mean, there's yeah. there's no doubt about it. That video has millions of views. So my photo is a photo of me. What the? Wait, who's this? Wait, wait, Haley, this better not be you, ma'am. I am, what, what's happening here? Um, so I'm- It's a beautiful photo. My butt's in Vogue. Does Vogue pay a lot? It's almost kind of like, like being a Playboy centerfold in a sense of like, it's an honor. Okay. Congrats on your new baby. Insert cash or select payment You're type. Funny. Use pin pad to complete transaction. I'm sorry, what? The average cost of childbirth and pregnancy <laughs> care in the U.S. is $6,940 with health insurance or $13,000 without. And it can vary wildly. I changed my mind. What's your return policy like? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying, Chad? Our noses smushed up against our kissing partner's face is actually opening up our nostrils and making their pheromones more obvious to us. And whether you realize it or not, your body will actually react to that person's pheromones and can make you more attracted to them if your body thinks they're a good biological match. Oh yes, I see. Best websites for Twitch streamers. Twitch Tracker is a website that tracks your stream data. It'll show you the max viewers, follower gains, and the amount of hours you stream per stream. They also have a very nice graph showing your average viewer count and the amount you streamed. And cool stats like average viewer count per day. Yeah, so I'm that's like similar to the type of Things content I, I do. Know. Let's check my Twitch tracker chat. Gifted active subs, 10187. All-time high active subs, 32 k Paid active subs, 11 k Current active subs, 13 k Highest record number of concurrent viewers, 50 k that's cap, bro. I got like 60k in DMM. Who remembers that 60k view count in DMM? I even like took a screenshot of that shit. I was like so surprised. Cap. I feel the like men should I want to up. put. I think your name is Teddy, right? Yes. You second because I saw that. I saw that ad. Tech pays well. That ad was really well edited. I'm pretty sure companies will see that and be like, I want. I want to go and sponsor him again. But I'll put you second. I right put now. you second. Yeah. Key. But I feel like Haley's sad from that. Like, bro, get, get your ass out. Like, start moving, you know? The influencers will now discuss follower counts. I need a pause here. So, 449k on TikTok, 700k on F Facebook, and... Se what? Holy Ziggy! 68k on Insta, 528k on TikTok, 50k Insta, 750k YouTube, 120k Insta, 326k... Yo, I'm not gonna lie. Don't be shocked by people's follower accounts on social media because a lot of people buy followers. I'm not saying these people did, but you know what I'm saying, right? Like the follower account matters? No. Oh, hell no. Absolutely, Absolutely not. not. It does for sponsors. They're retarded if they say no, but sure. Even I know that. How many hours do you guys work? I work every day. A lot. Yeah. Like this week, I worked like four 18 hour days. At minimum, there's no day where I'm working, le like almost every single day where I'm working less than five hours. And like when she was talking about like, oh, like work doesn't end, but like, it's like, it does. You can go get a smoothie and like sit in your bed and scroll emails. <laughs> it's not the same as like being expected to be somewhere and like be a slave all day and be off your phone. And like, you're not a person when you're at work. Good shit, Grace, good shit. To be a female YouTuber in a male dominated space in 2011 was traumatizing. Brutal. Okay, but I want to I want to say this though. I have it. I have a modeling agency, and eighty percent of the work that I get I get myself. That's fair. It's more about like see how she keeps gassing herself up and saying random ass shit. I really don't think I should be here. I think he needs you to be second. Oh, He's I employees. Do. I feel like I just want to move myself in between, in between us. You guys. I, I, that makes sense. Or to me. like lower. How do we feel about this? Seventh spot, Teddy, at one hundred and fifteen. Okay, Teddy makes 115k a year. Okay, clap in the chat for it. Not bad. What? What? That was a shocker. No way. Sixth spot, Haley, 125k. Damn, she's making 125k a year. It's not bad, Walla. Well, I'm making bank. 
Six figure club. <laughs> Six spot cat, 175K. Wait, she's making 175K a year? Educating Twitch streamers? How? 180K. Damn, she makes 180K a year just posting fashion shit. Respect. And the third spot, Josh, 275K. Holy shit! I knew you were up. Oh my, you know that cringe TikTok we watched earlier that we nobody thought that was funny? Say, well, like, he's making 275k or you're making content like that. No disrespect to you, sir, but like, damn, that wasn't funny. What the hell? Here. And in the second spot, Rhea, 300k. And the first spot, Kazumi, absolutely no Damn! Three million a year! Three million a year off of only Zans? Like that's fucking crazy, bro. Sex worker? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Fair w I tried retire so tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs>